that this movie fucking sucked. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Now I'm gonna piss off the Darren Aronofsky fanboys. Uh, that Noah sucked, okay? This movie was fucking boring. It made me fall asleep probably twice. I dozed off twice. I'm sorry, I didn't give a fuck about this movie. Nothing about it was interesting. At all. Russell Crowe is boring ass as Noah. I must, I must, I must say what God says, does, tells me to do. I must protect my family and banish all the wicked. Um. Yeah, Noah's a psychopath in this movie. Because. For some fucking reason, maybe you'll explain when I fucking fell asleep, but he doesn't want, or God doesn't want, his son and his, and his wife, and, you know, his son's wife to have, um, babies in the ark. You know, she's pregnant while they're in the ark. He finds out and he goes all fucking crazy and says, no, I must kill if it's a boy. You know, uh, it's all right. But if it's, if it's girl, if it's a girl, I'm fucking killing that baby. Um, they try to escape, uh, and in, you know, with the little boat, and he fucking breaks it because he's a fucking psychopath. And we're supposed to fucking root for this guy because the vil the real villain Ray Winston, he sneaks in. The arc when the flood's happening. I know I'm going all the fucking places. Fuck this movie. Uh, he, he, while the flood's going on, the great flood, he sneaks in the arc. I don't know how he's, you see him hanging out, out outside of the arc. The flood's coming. How the fuck does he survive? I don't know. This movie's bullshit. He somehow makes it in the arc, and one of, you know, Noah's youngest son. Who is against doesn't really like what Noah's saying or what he's doing as well. He kind of joins Ray Winston and the young son. He's played by Logan Lerman. He um I forgot his name. I don't care. But um and he says, "Oh, your dad. You know, you really agree that Ray Winston tells him you really agree with what your dad's doing and saying. Let's kill him together." And while that's going on, um you know. Noah's being a prick. He says, "Uh, if you, if you don't." Um, and the the pregnant girl is played by Emma Watson. Hermione is pregnant. Leave her alone. Uh, he's saying like, it, "It better not be a girl. I'm gonna kill. I'm gonna kill you, babies." Um. And then they find out it's it's twins. She gives birth to twins, and it's unfortunately two baby girls. And of course, Noah, like a fucking dick, tries to kill him. And he's just pushing everybody out of his way. And we're supposed to root for this guy? Really, this this whole thing I'm talking about, it's mostly just the third act of the movie? Like the last 40 minutes of the movie? Because that's most, mostly what I remember. Shitty subplot. Where the, our main hero fucking goes nuts. And we're supposed to root for him, really. Fuck Noah. The character in the movie. That's what I mean. Um, because mostly what I remember... Because this movie, is, this movie is also... I didn't fall asleep throughout the whole movie. I, I dozed off a bit, but... The rest of the movie is pretty forgettable. The only thing I remember was fucking... Rock monsters, really? These... Look, fucking, um, ridiculous looking rock monsters. Who are supposed to protect Noah and his family. I don't know what the fuck, they get the fuck out of, they get the fuck out, I don't remember what the hell happens to them. But they look fucking ridiculous. It, it, it seemed way out of place. They seem way out of place in this movie. Um.
Man. Darren, I'm sorry. Darren Aronofsky is an overrated director. Great. Okay, to be fair, I haven't seen all his movies. I've seen only a few. I thought The Wrestler was really, really great. Black Swan, I thought it was overrated. The only thing anyone ever remembers about the movie is Mila Kunis and Nelly Portman fucked. That's the only reason people like the movie. That's the only scene they remember. Because everything in that movie, everything else in that movie is fucking stupid. Overrated film. Um, this movie, overrated. It's a piece of shit. I'm sorry. Darren Aronofsky is not that great of a director. From what I've seen, except for The Wrestler. Maybe I need to see... Uh, Requiem for a Dream, I heard that was really good, but this movie, Noah, sucks ass. Sorry. It's fucking boring, it's pretentious, and your lead uh, hero is a fucking psycho dick. I kind of rooted for Ray Winstone to kill his ass. That actually kind of was about to happen, but... Um, I forgot who killed Ray Winstone. Um... Was it Logan Lerman? I don't fucking remember. And, um, the whole that shit happens. He decides not to kill the babies. Out of sympathy. And, um, uh, he, you know, he parts ways for, uh, for a few minutes in the movie. And then they find them. They, um, they kind of sort of drop the whole thing. And then Emma Watson just She's like, okay, we'll live together. Whatever. I will fucking, like, get my, uh, move my ass <laughs> millions and millions of miles away from this psychopath. Okay? He tried to kill the fucking babies. And Logan Lerman leaves. Um, whatever. I think everybody should have left Noah's ass. That's pretty much all I have to say about this movie. This movie sucked. Oh, and by the way, the CGI was fucking terrible. All the animals. Two of every animal. They look like shit. Just like the rock monsters. They look fucking ridiculous. So if you like this movie, fine, go ahead. That's fine. Cool. But this movie sucked. Fucking sucked. Um, so yeah, uh, I'm probably not gonna review anymore. Um, well, maybe just Exodus, but I'm, that's it. I'm not gonna read any more Bible-based films. No, I'm not gonna watch, I'm not gonna watch Son, Son of God. I've seen enough Jesus movies. Unless it's completely different. It's not, and by the way, this is not about, um, following the Bible. I don't really... Mind that, whatever, but as a movie, it fucking sucked. That's what I'm trying to say. Okay? And I'm not gonna, I'm probably not gonna watch God is Dead. I thought, from what I hear, it's fucking, it's gonna piss me off. Probably more than this movie. But I'm not gonna watch that movie. Forget it. Maybe Exodus, I don't know. It looked kind of dull. But I had a bad feeling about Noah from the get go. Ever since I saw the trailer, I thought it was dull. This movie was fucking dull. It's boring as fucking hell. No one, no one in this movie fucking should go to hell. Shit, I know that's harsh, but... You gotta kill fucking babies! Douche! Fucking prick. Fucking leave his ass... somewhere and get the fuck out of there, okay? Yeah. Oh, and by the way, Anthony Hopkins in this movie, I think. I don't know. Whatever. <laughs> I like Anthony Hopkins, but... God damn, why, why was he in this... Why was he, in, he even in this movie? But... Yeah, Russ... I... It, whatever, I'm... Oh, shit. I'm done. I'm done. Fuck Noah. The movie. And Aronofsky, 
try making less boring, pretentious films, okay? Alright, okay. Adios.